What's up? Just on my way back from the Seahawks victory over the 49ers. It's a great game. Uh, we really needed a game like this where uh, we just pretty much dominated the game and and uh, put away a team the way we ought to. And uh, just really proud of the team, the way they responded. Um, Russell Wilson had an amazing game, 24 of 29, his best efficiency, 80% plus completion rating, three touchdowns, uh, no picks, a couple of sacks, one was on him, but um, he ran the ball when the opportunities came, uh, made quick throws, and was just really smart with it. And so um, Russell had a great game. And so, again, I've never wavered in my support of Russell. I know a lot of people were jumping on his back this this uh, past week criticizing him and I've seen a lot of posts on Facebook just saying yeah we need to trade him for a real quarterback and this and that I'd like to see what they all have to say about him this week um, you know he, he was great so really proud of the way he played and of course uh, Thomas Rawls I mean man rookie broke um, Kurt Warner's rookie record 209 yards uh, broke the his record of 207 of yards in a game, 255, I think, believe, yards from scrimmage. And it's the first time ever in the history of the 49ers to have a 200 yard rusher against them. Um, and I was just listening on the radio to uh, Thomas Rawls' press conference. The guy is so, uh, so humble. He's inspiring to listen to. And it reminds me of uh, listening to Tyler Lockett talk um, in press conferences. The guys are both very hungry, very, very humble, very smart, but just really uh, uh, a gracious attitude and it's great to have guys new guys like that on the team knowing that they're gonna be with us for a long time and great playmakers so um, and the offensive line played really well I thought they protected Russell well I said two sacks one was really on Russell waited a little too long another one where he kind of scrambled out and you know um, just kind of went where the where the defenders were sort of lurking there um, but yeah they blocked great on the runs they were really moving to that next level where the line of scrimmage was really pushing forward um, you know some penalties but much more cleaned up from what it was last week um, Russell did a good job throwing the ball around spreading around uh, to different guys you know Graham had a few catches there Luke Wilson had catches Baldwin had a good game curse I believe he had a catch there got a took a slant and got slammed across the middle but held on to it made a play um, Tyler Lockett like I said earlier two touchdowns and uh, Rawls also uh, defense played great for most of the game I was disappointed that they gave that touchdown up at the end of the first half just because you know they gave up what it was like 80 something yard drive in like 90 seconds I mean it was so so quick you know, so didn't like seeing that, nor the other drive that, that they gave up. But 49ers made some adjustments at half. It seemed like they came out firing, but luckily Seattle bent, didn't break, didn't give up any big scores, kept it to field goals, and then uh, after the first half. And then Seattle answered kind of blow for blow, and then eventually just kind of warmed down and kept, uh, you know, kept the ball, wore out, ran out the clock, got the victory. So, you know, I know it's just one game. Next week, uh, it's a whole other thing when we've got the Steelers in town. That's going to be a good game. Um, totally different team. You know, Ben's out, Ben Roethlisberger's out there. He likes to throw the deep ball, especially to Antonio Brown. That guy's been tearing it up lately, so LOB's got to be on high alert with him. Um, but, again, I've been saying if Seattle just plays their style of football and just doesn't shoot themselves in the foot and executes the way – they know they can, uh, this team will be all right. So it's a good, good win. Hopefully the injuries that we saw, I mean, they start dropping like one play after another. Hopefully it's nothing serious and everybody's uh, able to, uh, you know, keep going. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be, uh, can we see the next one? So good game, we'll see if, uh, the Bengals can do us a favor and take the Cardinals out, and that would be huge. Uh, but can't worry about things out of our control. It's all about what the Seahawks can do. And today they did what they needed to do, get a good, solid win over a team that they should beat. And uh, that's five in a row over the Niners. 
So there you go. Um, yeah, one game at a time. Felt good about this one. All right, let's get Steelers next week. Go Hawks.